Matt Soka, and you're watching In The Mix on KUAM. Soka is Jared and Janiki Suba, Matthew Sablon, RJ Pereira, Rudy Duenas, and Daniel Tapasna. Now don't let their youth fool you. This group of talented musicians was introduced to music early. Jared and Janiki attribute their love for music to their mother, Joylene, and Matthew says his dad used to make him listen to artists like Stevie Wonder, Earth, Wind and & Fire, and even the Isley Brothers. Janiki, who plays keyboards and does backup vocals, says when coming up with a band name, a decision ultimately had to be made because a producer needed it. Toka um, is a name that I sort of dwelled on for a while, and um, when we needed the name in like a minute to give to the producers, I'm just like, guys, sorry, it's, it's gotta be Toka. <laughs> Through time, the name stuck, and just like their name, how the group was formed is just as interesting. How we came together was a uh, Shannon McManus and her little sister Siobhan and I. Uh, it was us three, and then um, we were asked to play for the Green concert, and um, we needed a backup band. So I pulled in Jared to play percussions. He pulled in Matt to play or to sing uh, Mel parts. <laughs> And then um, we had Dan Tapasnia play guitar for us. Then he pulled in RJ Pereira the same day of the concert. So it, it was sort of magic and, you know, by chance that we came together. Lead vocalist Matthew, whose voice is oozing with soul, best describes Toka's sound. We're kind of like a buffet. We have a little bit of everything, but we kind of do a lot of funky stuff, a lot of R&B-ish kind of music. And, you know, we just like to play what everybody likes to hear. Toka enjoys playing music, period, and you can hear it in every performance. The group has a strong following, and they even have the opportunity to open for the Matish Yahoo concert and partake in other big events. Now, each member has different musical influences, which is reflective in the plethora of songs they perform. John Mayer. For me, it's um, every local musician who's been there and done that, made the sacrifices. You know, shout out to DUB, really look up to those guys, Uncle Patrick. Jesse and Ruby. I was going to say that, but anyway. Well, like old school, I would like to say uh, Stevie Wonder, Bob Marley, of course. Just, um, yeah, John Mayer. I like John Mayer, too. I have to give all my uh, influences to my mom. If it wasn't for my mom, uh, I wouldn't be playing music. So, yeah, I have to give it all to my mom. Toka remains humble and is grateful for the support they receive from not just fans, but also other local artists that they look up to as well. I'd like to shout out to all of Guam's local musicians that are doing their thing. I'd also like to shout out to, who else? Old Man Rebel, Sriracha, some um, Mad Men and Lady McManus. Um, who else? There's just so many great musicians here and I love, huh? Beautiful Elders, my other band that I'm in. Awesome guys, love them very much. Shout out to uh, all of Guam's local musicians and international musicians and uh, um, service entrance because you guys are awesome. I love you guys so much. If you would like to catch Toka, check them out every Wednesday night at the Beach Bar in Tumon or every Friday night at Mac and Marty's. And for the very latest on Toka, look for them on Facebook. <laughs>